Hi guys, we are going to play a game today. It's a game of numbers and uh, I'm going to play this game with Rachit. What I'll be doing is having an original array which is 2, 5, 8, 15 and 20. Now what Rachit needs to do is guess this array. And of course I won't give him the original array. Instead I'll give him a matrix of each element equal to, so m of ij is equal to the gcd of element at i and element at j. But I notice one thing, when I'm doing this uh, and I have this matrix, if I give him the matrix directly, he can find the original array just using the diagonal elements because uh, that will be a of i and a of i. So the gcd of the element with itself is the element itself. As you can see, there's two, five, five and five over here, eight, 15 and 20. So that's the original array. You can see some elements like 5 over here, which is the GCD of 5 with 15 and 4, which is the GCD of 20 with 8. So these elements are nice because they're encapsulating some information. They're not going to give you the direct element just by looking at it. Now, like I said, I can't send him the original matrix. Instead, I will shuffle the matrix and convert that to an array. So all the elements will be written out in a random order, maybe 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 5, 4, 5, 20 so on and so forth, I'll go around in a spiral, convert it into an array and then send it to Rachit and let's see if we can find out the original elements using this shuffled array. Hey Rachit, yeah I have an interesting problem for you. Uh, you need to guess a set of numbers alright, uh, I am just sending you the details right now. Hey guys, so I have written the numbers that Gaurav just gave me and I have written them in ascending order just to make some sense out of what I am dealing with and I have also uh, generated a 5 cross 5 matrix because the numbers have to be a perfect square, so 25, it's a square of 5, so I know that there are 5 numbers that I have to guess and what I'm going to do is, I will try my best to fill this matrix in the right way so that I can finally just iterate on the diagonal elements to tell Gaurav the original 5 numbers that he had in his mind. Um, so let's get started with it. Um, Alright, so I'm dead sure that this number that we have over here is 20 and this is one of the five numbers that Gaurav was having because uh, this the numbers in the matrix are GCD of two numbers from the array which means those numbers have to be smaller than the numbers in the array right so I know that in this matrix the GCD of the greatest element that Gaurav has thought will occur right so and the greatest number here is 20 so I'm dead sure it is coming from the GCD of 20 and 20 so this number right over here is 20 that I know the only that way we can get a 20 here all right so this is out of the picture next I have is 15 and that will be the second largest element that Gaurav had so this is right here and then I can also know that over here we will have the GCD of 15 and 20 so this will be I think 5 and this also 5 and this number is 15 so I need to remove two fives from here now because I've already processed them. So I know the greatest number, the next number after that, and I've also removed the GCDs. Hmm. Now let's remove this 15. Now we have eight, which will be the third largest element that Gaurav was having. So now I can remove eight, but now I also need to remove the GCDs that we have over here. So the GCD of 8 and 15, so basically this is 8 and now let's remove this, this is 1 and this is 4, um, this is 1, this is 4. So let's remove two ones and two 4s. Alright, what is the next greatest element? Um, that's 5, so I know that his second smallest number is 5. And now let's remove the GCDs for this. So for 5 and 8, it's 1. 5 and 15 is 5. 5, 20 is also 5. So let's remove 4 5s and 2 1s now. Alright. And 1 5 for the number itself. So now we just have to. Guys, after we perform this, I think the array should be completely over. And all the numbers that we want to delete should be present. Otherwise, this will go wrong, right? So let's see. So the GCD of 2 and 5 is 1, 2 and 8 is 2, then this is 1, this is 2, 
and same here of course this matrix will be a symmetric matrix because gcd of ai aj is same as gcd of aj ai right so this matrix is symmetric now let's remove what we have to so we have five twos and then four ones and i think i think i have cracked the problem i have cracked the five numbers that gaurav was thinking now let me just call gaurav and tell him what i have done hey gaurav i i think i have cracked those five numbers were those 2 5 8 16 16 and 20 i am hmm. wrong yeah because it's not 16, it's not ah, no. hey guys uh, this is gaurav and this is rachet it's our first collaboration i hope you enjoyed it i hope the problem was fun to solve and if you want more such videos please subscribe <laughs> and share this video i'll see you next time bye is my edit nahi karna theek hai and now let's see now after this operation <laughs> hello kaun hai